Hello, I'm Tom and Homi from Dell EMC. In this demonstration video, I'll be presenting Dell EMC Project Karavi and review its features and capabilities. Project Karavi is an open source project developed by Dell Technologies. The project aims at improving the observability, usability, and data mobility for stateful applications with Dell Technologies storage portfolio. Project Karavi, together with the CSI plugins and the pioneering AppAware app-consistent backup and recovery solutions, forms the most comprehensive enterprise-grade storage and data protection solutions for Kubernetes from Dell Technologies. At the moment, Project Karavi is in tech preview and includes Karabi Observability. Karabi Observability provides standardized approach for storage observability. This project brings capacity and performance metrics collection as well as basic storage topology by pulling the data from the storage array and the CSI drivers and sending it to Grafana and Prometheus, community-driven open source tools which became the de facto standard for collecting and visualizing various Kubernetes ecosystem metrics. Karavi observability supports PowerFlex systems and more storage arrays will be added in the next couple of months. The project includes two services. Karavi topology provides visibility into Dell EMC CSI, the container storage interface driver, provisioned volumes in Kubernetes, and Karavi metrics for PowerFlex captures telemetry data about Kubernetes storage usage and performance and pushes it to open telemetry collector every 10 seconds by default. So it can be processed and exported in a format consumable by Prometheus. Prometheus can then be configured to scrape the open telemetry collector exporter endpoint to provide metrics so they can be visualized in Grafana. The components have been designed to be extensible and more collectors for PowerStore, PowerScale, PowerMax, and Unity are expected to be released in the next couple of months. Now, let's review the components and the performance dashboards. This project is deployed using Helm. Operator support will be added in the future. To view the different pods, I'm running the kubectl get pods and specifying the Kravi namespace. The application requires Prometheus and Grafana components to be deployed in the same Kubernetes cluster as the Karavi Metrics Parflex service. As part of the Karavi observability deployment, the Open Telemetry Collector gets deployed. The Open Telemetry Collector is what the Karavi Metrics services used to push metrics so it can be consumed by Prometheus. This means that Prometheus must be configured to scrape the metrics data from the open telemetry collector. Now I'm running the kubectl get pods and kubectl get pvc. As you can see, I deployed multiple pods which are connected to PowerFlex persistent volumes and running intensive cloud native workloads inside the containers. By navigating to the PowerFlex UI, we can perform standard configuration and maintenance activities and to monitor the health and performance of the storage system. We can use the UI to view the entire system and explore different elements as well as provision and modify many of the PowerFlex front-end and back-end components and features. Now, let's navigate to the Grafana UI and review the Karavi dashboards. Once Grafana and Prometheus are properly configured, you can import the pre-built observability dashboards and of course, each dashboard can be edited and modified so you can build your own customized dashboards. The first dashboard is Kubernetes Admin Dashboard. This one provides visibility into the Dell EMC CSI driver provisioned volumes characteristics in Kubernetes correlated with volumes on the storage array. Here, you can find very useful information about the Kubernetes persistent volumes, such as the PV name and PVC name, 
status, namespace, size, creation date, and more. The next dashboard is storage pool and storage class capacity. These dashboards provide visibility into the total used and available capacity for a storage class and associated underlining storage construct. The volume IO metrics dashboard provides visibility into the IO performance metrics, IOPS, bandwidth, and latency by volume. This dashboard is very really useful as it can allow you to view the performance metrics for each and every Kubernetes persistent volume and detect performance issues or abnormal behaviors. We can filter the information by volume ID, volume name, Kubernetes node ID or IP, and change the time frame. The storage system IO metrics by node provides visibility into the IO performance metrics, IOPS bandwidth and latency by Kubernetes node. We can filter by specific node and receive accurate live and history performance data. Together with the PowerFlex UI, Caravi Observability provides end-to-end -end performance monitoring solution for Kubernetes cloud-native applications running on top of PowerFlex storage systems, from the PowerFlex storage building blocks to the application persistent volumes. If you want to know more, feel free to check our GitHub project page, github.com slash dell slash Karavi, or reach out directly at the Dell Containers community. I hope you'll find this demo useful, and thank you very much for watching.